Hey loves, welcome back. Today we are doing a much needed Unwind Sunday. I wanted to bring you guys along with me on my Sunday. This Sunday I really focused on unwinding and giving myself a break, trying to do things that please my soul and my heart this Sunday. I actually don't drink coffee that often, but I thought it would be nice to treat myself this Sunday morning with some coffee. And then I went into my little prayer slash journal corner. This is where I get the best sunlight, honestly, and I just sit on my little furry rug and I either journal, read the Bible. Today I kind of did both, did a little bit of Bible reading and studying and did some journaling. It is very important to me if I ever need to unwind or reset or I'm feeling drained to make sure I include God in my reset routine. I try to include him every day and every second of my day, but I really like to sit down and focus. And I am pretty new to my faith, stepping into it a bit deeper this year. So I wanted to make sure I have some dedicated time set to the side so I can read the word. So I personally love technology, so I use my iPad for a lot of digital type of reading and writing. But if you want to be like screen free, definitely recommend that. I kind of don't really go on my phone on Sundays, but I use my iPad a lot. I don't normally journal every day, but I do love a good weekly journal. So some prompts I do love to use is what did I accomplish this week? What lessons did I learn this week? How did I take time for myself? And what am I most grateful for? That prompt is really important to me because I try to live my life as best as I can in a state of gratitude. One of my favorite things to do on my unwind Sundays is to go outside and get fresh air. I love the beautiful weather we've been having lately. I'm obsessed with the birds chirping and the blue skies and the nice breeze, the green trees, the flowers. I love it all. And the best thing I get to do is do it with my husband. Quality time is one of my favorites. It helps me unwind and recharge. Just spending time with the loved ones, especially my husband, is just a blessing. So it's Sunday evening now and your girl loves a good spa vibe. I'm all about bougie on a budget. You do with what you have. If you can't afford to go to a spa all the time, make one at home. Spas and bubble baths are so relaxing. They definitely can help you unwind. I don't care if it's the summer or the winter, your girl is going to be having a warm magnesium bath. So I add all this stuff to my bath to make it even more extra and a little bit more unwinding. So I add some magnesium flakes, some Epsom salts, some body oils, and I add some bubble bath, of course. And to make it even more extra, I added a little bath tray with some items on it. I put some candles around the tub. I put a cold glass of water. You can do wine if you drink wine, but your girl don't drink wine. So I did some water. I did my body scrub, my brush, all that. Lit the candles, turned the lights down low. It's all about doing the things I love and the things I think relax and calm me. And bubble bath are one of those. To give it more of a spa vibe, I am doing a face mask. I normally do this once a week anyways, but you might as well make it a bit more extra and more relaxing. So I just put the clay mask all over my face and then I got in the bath and just enjoyed a warm, relaxing bubble bath. After the bubble bath, I get out and I put my bonnet on. I just could not wait to put it on. I love my bonnet. It makes me feel so relaxed and unwind. And then I do my skincare routine. I love a good moisturizing routine, especially when it comes to relaxing and just, you know, when your body's all moisturized up, it just feels the best. I put on my favorite pair of pajamas and my fluffy slippers, and I get ready to just get cozy and unwind. Tonight, your girl is watching some netflix and eating her favorite food but before that i'm gonna prep the room so i turn down the lights 
put on my little warm lights as you guys can see make it more like warm toned light a candle on my unwind sundays i like to treat myself with either like a favorite meal or something i've just been craving and your girl loves sushi if i'm doing a treat me type of night i am eating sushi i get cozy and comfortable get my netflix going and enjoy my food like i said your girl loves sushi so i was really enjoying it and then i just spend the rest of my night chilling really that's all it is on my sundays i keep it very easy very easy going i think i watch more netflix for the rest of the night and then i went to bed but that is really it for my little unwind Sunday. I hope you guys enjoyed. I feel like everybody deserves some time to unwind and come back to themselves. So I hope you guys can create some time for that. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.